Hello. You know, I know we've talked, I won't, I will just be oh. brief, but we've talked probably a couple years ago. We just happened to be doing the territory again. So I said, I want to try this man and see if I talk. <laughs> and I, you said, you had a certain position, I'm a minister, you had a certain position on the Bible, and I can't remember, was it was that agnostic? Or? Oh, I'm agnostic, yeah. That's not, yeah, that's, that's what not, I thought, that's yeah. what I thought, yeah. Um, well, the door's still open then, if you're agnostic. Do you, do you know what agnostic is? Uh, well... There's different versions of it. Um, sure. Some people feel that um, that God may exist, but He's not taking an active part in human affairs. That's generally what I generally what I view as an agnostic. No, oh, well, uh, I, but some I, some move close towards atheism. So I, I don't know how you feel. Yeah, yeah. I mean, there are varying mm -hmm. degrees. Sure, you're right. Yeah. Um, a, a, agnostic uh, for me and a lot of other people, I would say, would be the belief in a God, a higher power, and everything, and, you know, creator and stuff, just that yeah. uh, he doesn't require to be worshipped because he's God, and he doesn't need that from us. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, uh, that's that's a kind of... We, we, need, we need his help. We, he doesn't need ours. Oh, exactly. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Exactly. But he but he tells us, and I'm, 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 I'm Tom. Your first name again was? Steve. Steve, my brother's name. Okay, Steve. Uh, he does tell us he wants us to worship him. Okay, the scriptures say that. I well, I don't believe it. <laughs> so you don't believe the Bible? Right. Oh, so you believe in existence. But well, doesn't stand the reason that God would try to communicate I think, with I us? I think that if, if God wrote a book of instructions, it would yeah. be short and simple to understand, not long and full of riddles. Okay, uh, well, if you examine it closely... And, and, and orders for murder. Uh, okay, uh, there's lots of things here. Okay. Uh, there are, lots, example, there, there are Hebrew, lots of things okay. here. In the Hebrew scriptures, all right, there was war, yes, mm -hmm. okay? But he had to protect the seed of promise because he said that G Jesus would come in David's line. Yeah. So he had to protect the Israelites from enemy nations around them. Okay. So and also with the Canaanites when he entered the promised land, he had he told them. Again, it's just stories. I don't believe. <laughs> <laughs> all, all right. Of it, yeah. All of it. Okay. All right. Um, it, God, right. God. God has spoken to me and stuff. You know, He's shown me things in in my life, and I feel full of God, and I don't okay. require a book. Oh, you uh, oh, okay. All right. I'll tell you what. I don't require an organization. Just at least leave this with you. Just think <clears throat> about some of the things that hey, you, well, the way the scriptures answer it. See if it see if it, it, it agrees with what you've been told by God. I'm uh, so, I'm I'm glad enough. again that you know you're in an organization that loves kids so much. Oh, you do. <laughs> yes. Yes, you, you have do. children. I do. Yeah, we have. I love a, I love them a different way. Though. Well, let me sh let me just show you something. On the I back. do have to go back and. Yeah, I'm just gonna. I'm, I understand. Yeah, it's free. JW.org. You'll find things I, for kids. I, I thank children. you for for you know tr <laughs> okay, trying Steve. to do good. Okay, all right. Well, we're all in perfect. I I yeah. All, I, I appreciate Jesus, you tr trying all, to do good. We all need Jesus' blood to, to you know to have a good relationship yes. with our Creator. All right. But if you have children, JW.org has cartoons for kids which highlight moral themes. Yeah. Okay. Take care. Phallic themes.